information. What information, O'Brien? Hey, I got it. What the hell can you possibly have left to say? That I would give a damn about. So what the hell? I managed to recruit a few guys who I trust to let me aren't happy with what's going on. So why am I here? I wanted to give you this. You were right about your wife. How did you get this? When Silver Lake evacuated, they took Nero personnel, federal officials, and well, Sarah Irene Whitaker had a class four federal clearance level. Clearance level. The wife bugged out with a recon unit east of Fort Rock. Take me there. No. No. Well, you got a ride. We're all friends now. The base is gone. What? A year ago. Local militia group. Militia group? Where's their camp? We don't know. How the hell can you not know? You got a helicopter. You got satellites. Somewhere around Crater Lake, but it's a no-fly zone, okay? They got outposts, rockets, RPGs. Crater Lake. Crater Lake. I wanted to tell you about the work we're doing. Studying the infected, the freaks. They're evolving. As bad as things are right now, they're gonna get worse. A lot worse. Boozer, Booze man, come back. Yeah, Dean. Hey, listen, listen to me. Uh, a year ago, we were with Iron Mike. We were thinking about riding south, but the Santium Pass was blocked. There was no way through, and he said that he knew another way. Just listen to me. Just listen to me. Do you remember what he said? Iron Mike? Yeah, he was, he was bragging about no one ever would go trail in 100 miles. And it was, uh, Tielson, Tielson, yeah, that's it. Tielson, pass. Yeah, why the hell you... Shit. You've talked to him. She's alive? Sarah's alive? Hey, 
listen to me. O'Brien, they, uh... Loser, you found her ID badge. Loser, uh... I, I think that she's alive. Dave, never lost hope. You always knew. You never gave up. So what are you gonna do? I don't know, Loser. I don't know, uh, but... There's even a chance that she's alive. I... Find her. Got that right. Uh, shit, I, I gotta go. Uh, Ricky and Annie need, need help putting up a shelf or some goddamn thing. But, uh, I'll see you when you get back to camp. Okay, okay. See you, booze, man. Hey, Ricky. Um, I I got some shit I gotta take care of. Are you coming back? I'm coming back. What, what do you What do you mean? Who's your told us? <laughs> Who told you? Okay, look. There's nothing to tell. There's no way over the stadium pass. You know that. Yes, yes. I'm coming back. Listen, like I said, I got some shit to do. Peeking out. You know, way over the Tielson Pass. He told me once that I I'd... told you nothing. Go on. Oh, I can't on. help you, Deke. Just draw me a goddamn map. After everything you've done. After everything I've. What about what you've done, old man? Huh? Oh. Sherman's you camp. The things that you, you get did. Out of here. You no, leave listen me. Listen to me. What if? You could take it all back, huh? What if you could fix it? I thought I put Sarah on a chopper. I felt relieved. How fucked up is that? Uh, I was relieved. Mike, that's what I've been living with. And now you're chasing ghosts. You think finding your old lady, if she's alive, you think that's gonna fix it? Make you whole? I don't know, but I gotta try. All right. If I do this, what you want, show you the way over the pass. You don't come back. All right, you promised me you don't come back. I got gotcha. you. <sighs> Shit, I gotta talk to Boozer. Last winter, we were up on Farewell Ridge. We were watching the freaks. Thousands, thousands of them. I mean, too many to count. Yeah, I remember. All I could think was 
Every one of us, man, woman, and child, are now homeless. A bunch of goddamn refugees. Yeah. World belongs to them now. We'll survive. <laughs> yeah, we've been doing that all right. Surviving isn't living. <laughs> Something Jack used to say. Doesn't matter when you hit the road where you're heading out to, but you damn well better know where you're coming home to. You know, we never talked about it while we still wore the colors all this time out in the freak show when shit like this didn't matter anymore. Yeah, yeah but I think. Last two mongrels on Earth, farewell originals. Uh, the biker boys, most badass drifters on the broken road. Damn straight. Yeah, I guess we did become sort of a brand. Uh, we were a lot of things, but we were never a brand. <laughs> <laughs> We rode out of farewell without Sarah, without Jack or anyone. I knew that we were leaving everything behind. Everything that mattered was gone. Said this. You're a nomad again, huh? Yep. I guess I am. Come on, Jack. Inside, let's go. If she's out there, we'll find her. Yeah, Mike, I'm ready. Meet me at the gate. Don't keep me waiting. Yeah, sure, Mike, whatever you say. Hey. Our big Mike is taking you over the pass? Yep. You really think she's still alive? Billions of people are dead, but somehow she made it. Hey, we made it, didn't we? If I give up now, if I don't... if I don't do this... Well, then I'm just gonna end up like, uh... Like us. Right? Like Iron Mike, like Boozer? What'd you call us? Campers, yeah? You go... and you find your woman. You know where to find me. Hey, you know what? You know what I think, Deacon? I think that you're you're afraid to be here. You're afraid to be a part of something. We need you here, and that scares the hell out of you. I'm sorry. <sighs> yeah, me too. You ready? Yeah, I want to get the hell out of here. following you.
Jack out fishing once. Before, you know. Oh shit. I got one. Didn't know what the hell to do with it. <laughs> that sounds like Jack. Oh, you ran a pretty tight club. Or you boys raised some hell back in the day. I don't think you murdered anyone. Not in cold blood. It's not murder if they shoot at you first. we used to get through here come summer? A few. Thousands. Too many to count. Highway be bumper to bumper with SUVs and campers chock full of sunburned moms, beer chugging dads, and their snot-nosed kids. Goddamn rainbow of floppy hats, Hawaiian shirts, and flippy flops. All summer long they come. A trail of colorful ants from L.A. to farewell to here. Non-stop. Glad I avoided road trips out here that time of year. As far as I go, keep following the trail. It'll take you down the mountain, on into the diamond-like valley. I wish you luck. Hope you're right about your old lady still being alive. She is. Well, maybe so. But you gotta ask yourself, Deke. What does it matter if everyone else is dead?
What the hell? Jesus, I don't Mr. know what we would have done without oh, you, man. Oh, come on. Hey, okay, okay, all right, all right, all right. It's dead. It's cool. Man of the hour. Oh, God. I'm Russell. Glenn Russell. This is Private Mullins. Uh, Rick. Hey, Rick. Uh, I'm Deacon St. John. Did, did you say private? Yeah. Yes, sir. The Shoots County Militia. You're not from around here. You come over the pass? Uh, no, no, no. I've just been uh, drifting. I came over the uh, salt flats east of Silver Lake. <laughs> What? what the hell are you doing out here, man? How'd you get across the 97? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus, man. What? This guy just saved your freaking life. The colonel told us to look out for anybody entering the territory, north or south. Freaking slow your roll, man. We'll let the captain deal with that, okay? Fine. He just killed a freaking ranger, dude. Come with us. We got a camp just by Diamond Lake. Get you three hots in a cot. Least we can do. Okay, yeah, sounds good. What about Flores? We can't just leave him here. Uh, you stay here. I'll come back with some fuel. No! Listen, stay here. Use his ammo if you gotta. You'll be fine. Okay? Let's go. Following you. Shoots County Militia? Look, man, all I know is they feed me. They want me to salute and yes, sir. I salute and say yes, sir. How big's your outfit? The camp out here? We got a hundred, maybe more. Hard to keep track. Back at HQ, a whole lot more than that. Yeah, okay. Uh, any women? Hell, that we you're about? Well, you can forget it. Colonel's got rules about that. Frat, fratern, fraternity. Fraternizing! <laughs> yeah, that. Look, you pull your weight, follow orders, nobody messes with you. Women same as the men. Don't matter to the colonel. I'm not... Oh, listen, I, I'm just... I'm looking for some people and a woman that I rode with a year back or so. They would have come over from Silver Lake. They would have been at one of those Nero refugee camps, I think. Silver Lake? Jesus, man. Silver Lake's been gone a lot longer than that. Yeah, yeah. It's too goddamn easy to lose track of time out of here, you know? Anyway, you guys, uh... Do you pick anyone up? Survivors, I mean, from uh, from the refugee camp? Maybe. Like I said, it's a big freaking army, you know? Ask the captain. He came in across the salt flats, I think. He might know. The captain? Yeah, Corey. He commands the Diamond Lake outpost. We're almost there. This is it. It's Corporal Russell. Open up. Port. Captain, sir, we had him. We did. Found his bike still smoking. I bet you lost him, huh? No, sir. I mean, yeah, we lost him. We ran into a rager, sir. Where's Mullins? Flores? Flores is dead, sir. I'll have Mullins with a body. That'll be all, Corporal. Go get some fuel. Head back to Mullins. You know what to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for this man, we'd all be dead, sir. 
I sort of promised him some food and a safe place to camp tonight, sir. Corporal, get the fuck out of here. And you are? Name's Deacon St. John. Name's Corey. Derek Corey. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. I've been on the road for a long time. Your man Russell said you were recruiting. Are you interested? I've been looking to settle down. Yeah, find a camp. I'm interested. Come on. So, how long have you drifted? Hard to say. Uh, you lose track of time out there, you know. So, uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ammo. Well, there was a couple of camps I used to do runs for. Bounty hunting, mostly. Freaks? Or oh, men? Both. I had a reputation for being able to track shit down, you know? Well, which camps? Where are they? You know, past the Farewell Valley. It doesn't matter. They're gone now. They're overrun. Uh, Russell said you were there when Silver Lake was overrun. <laughs> yeah. That was a shit show, I can tell you. Uh, any survivors? A few. Here. Take this. Militia script. Camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? I can recruit you. But the colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. Jesus. Jesus, motherfucker, has my ring. He took it from Sarah. He had to take it from Sarah because she wouldn't have given it to him. So that means that she's got to be here. He doesn't look like militia. Go, go, go! You gotta move your ass! You think you're gonna outrun the freaks? Hell no, you're not! Come on, you gotta work! Yes! Yes! Sir. Yes! yes. Sergeant! Moving. Sir. Sir! Moving! Sir! Why are you not working hard? Why are you... Hey. Uh, you don't look very militia to me. No, um, man, name's Wade. Wade Taylor. You can call me Wade. Deacon St. John. <laughs> Holy Listen. shit! Deacon St. John? Is your old man a preacher or something? No. Man, that is a hell of a name. Alright, listen. You Wade. see this, man? This is some crazy shit. Yeah. Whew. So what, you joining up, becoming an army man? You playing soldier and shit? I don't know, maybe. Listen, uh, you look like you just came in from out the shit, right? Yeah, man, yesterday. Okay, yesterday. I've been, been waiting to see the colonel, whatever the hell that is. Traveling with some people, we got separated. You see anyone that looked like this around here? Uh, nah, man. Ooh, she is a looker. I'd hit that, you know. <laughs> uh, I gotta go, man. They're checking me for lice or some shit. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Jesus, what a name. Jesus, that dude's fucked up. He wouldn't remember Sarah if she slapped him in the face. Oh, come on, Sarah, come on. Where the hell are you? You're here. Somewhere. Maybe in these tents. Maybe in here. Nope, not here. Oh God, I'm glad Sarah and I never had Moving. kids. Yes. Losing them must have been. Moving, Check whoa, this one. Whoa, whoa. The infirmary. I mean, with her background, that's where she would be, right? 
God damn it, I should not hear either. You're not looking so good. That's gotta be the one. Sarah? Sarah, you in here? Shit, not here. Oh, God damn it, she's not here. She's not here, but... Right, yeah, yeah, it couldn't be that easy. No, could it? St. John, are you on this channel? Corporal Russell said you had a radio. Yeah, yeah, uh, I'm here. Meet me at the gate. On my way. Getting ready to ride out. You still coming? Ready when you are. Looks like you put a lot of work into this. Yeah, some. Looks like a forest fire, but the stumps are charred. So that means that means that the timber was cut before it was burned. You got a good eye. We call it the dead zone. We use the timber to build our barricades and burn the slash. From the outpost, we can see a horde coming long before it reaches us. And what? You're gonna burn all the buildings too, so the newts and the swarmers have nowhere to sleep? You know you're freaks, huh? Like I said, I've been out in the ship for a long time. So that's your plan, huh? The militia, I mean, to burn everything to the ground? We're fighting a war out here, St. John. We'll do whatever it takes to win. A war? That's what it is, isn't it? A war? You've been out in the shit. You've seen the hordes. The only thing that's gonna stop them is an army. Our army. It's gonna take way more than an army. We have a plan. The Colonel lets you join. We'll fill you in. So, Silver Lake, you asked about survivors. Someone? No, no, not really. I mean, look, there were some folks that I rode with once, and I thought maybe they ended up there. Uh, I thought maybe you were after something. For a bounty, I mean. Yeah, no. I tracked men over long distances before, but not this far. No bounty's worth that. Captain's here. It's done, sir. Make sure you make a marker. Yes, sir. All right. You two head back to Diamond Lake. Grab, uh, Taylor was his name? Yes, sir. Yeah. Take him to the Colonel. I'll be there in 1800. Sir? Military time, Corporal. You're supposed to know this by now. Oh, yes, sir. Get the fuck out of here. Yes, sir. You find something? Uh, how long is, uh... Vasquez. Well, has Vasquez been with you guys? A couple of weeks, maybe more. <laughs> well, he's been busy. What the hell? You guys been having trouble with supply runs, marauder attacks? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go on foot from here. On foot? Why? <laughs> because Vasquez came out here for a reason. I can't track him from the bike. Where do we start? It's been snowing, so, uh, there won't be any boot prints. Come on, I want to look inside the cabin. Okay, I'm following you. So he stole rations, ammo? 
Yes. This is an MRE. It's half eaten, so looks like your men rode up on him when he wasn't expecting it. His bike's still out front, which means that he went out the back. Wait, over here. What would you find? The fence has been cut. And the rust. So it was cut recently? Yeah, come on, this way. Hey, hold on for a second. Look. Over here. Tracks? Uh, yeah, we're in luck. This way. Wait, 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 hold up. What, you find something? Yeah, shell casing. Recently fired. He, uh, well, he stopped to shoot at something. Come on, down here. Hold up, hold up. What, is it infected? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Um, come on, I want to take a look at that deer carcass. Go on, get out of here. What are you doing? That ever worked for you? Yelling at a wolf? Yeah, depends. On what? On how hungry it is. More wolves! I see him! Finally. That's the last of them. Okay, I want to take a look at this thing. Looks like the MREs weren't enough for your man. Clean gunshot right through the head. Yeah, the wolves must have heard the shot. Decided they wanted it more than Vasquez. Yeah, the rest of the pack came at us from back that way, from the east. You think they chased off Vasquez, leaving one to guard the carcass? That's my guess. Come on, let's see if you're right. You guys got a lot of wolves out here? Ones that aren't infected, I mean? Yeah, we get reports almost every day. When I was a kid growing up, there were no wolves in Oregon. I mean, a few coyotes, but no wolves. They'd been driven to extinction by ranchers and farmers, timber companies. Well, it looks like they're making a big comeback. Hold up, hold up, hold up. But what is it? It's a backpack. It's one of ours. Looks like they almost got to him. And he shrugged off the pack to get away. No, no, no. To buy time. He landed on his ass. Tried to scramble away, but then the wolf lunged. Vasquez dropped him. Two shots. You can tell all that. Yeah. Down, a swarm. Near our grave site. This one is marked on our map. They're scattered all over the region. Now, maybe that explains why uh, Vasquez came through here. Let's go around. Exactly what I was thinking. Is it John? This one? Yeah, right there with you. I gotta say, I get tired running and hiding from these sons of bitches. You ever take on a swarm? Yeah, not before. We just gotta keep moving. Look, you're gonna join the militia? You must stay focused on the mission. We're not out here to fight freaks. Being in the shit, killing freaks, it kinda goes hand in hand, doesn't it? Okay, um, put some distance between us and the graves. The cold weather's gonna bring out even more of them. I think they can smell the corpse from about a mile out. Part of our slash and burn strategy is to find these grave sites, dig them up, and burn them along with everything else. Yeah, well, good luck with that. I've seen hundreds of them. It's just in this part of the state alone. And we gotta start somewhere. All right, where now? Keep heading east. Hey, there's a road ahead. Hold up a second.
What do you think? Is anyone else tracking him? Not that I know of. Huh. Well, then he's either dead, or he's got a lot of friends. You see how his tracks have been overridden by bikes. A lot of bikes. Hmm. Okay. Come on. Let's see where they're heading. You said cold weather brings out the freaks? Yeah, yeah. Cold, snow, rain, hell, even clouds. Well, like I said before, you know your freaks. When we get to command, there's some people who want to talk to you. People? The Colonel will fill you in, if he lets you join. Yeah, yeah, I think you said that already. He runs a tight outfit. I just don't want you to get your hopes up. Hey, wait. Hear that? Yeah, it's coming from the logging camp over there. Is that on your map? Yeah. Oh, that means it's also on Vasquez's map. Come on. If Vasquez is there, what would your strategy be? Well, he's not alone. We know that from the tracks. What's that militia penalty for going AWOL? Hanging by the neck until dead. Why? Well, it means Vasquez isn't coming without a fight. Checks on your recruits. He seems to be right at home. Well, let's wait here. I'll radio for backup. Get your goddamn hands off me! Oh, oh this one's a fighter, boys! On. What do you think? Oh, come on, boss, oh, about that. <laughs> oh, hell no. What? Uh, I just got this problem with assholes who hurt unarmed women. I'm giving you an order. Order? <laughs> you see me wearing a red armband? You don't give me orders yet. You do whatever the hell you want. <laughs> I got a use for you. I 
that tight. This is it. I can get in through here. Hey, whoa, 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 easy, easy. I'm not gonna. I'm just here to help. I don't need your goddamn help. Okay. I'm just gonna move over here. How was that? Just your typical damsel in distress. Vasquez? Done. Way done. Captain Corey? Come in. This is Corey. We're here. Heading up the road to the main gate. Hold your position there. We're coming. What about the enemy? They've been, uh, uh neutralized. Uh, Hold your position. Hurry out. Come on. We brought up your bikes, Captain. Thought we'd save you the walk back. That'll be all, Corporal. So how'd I do? Did I pass? Pass? Oh, you've been watching me all day. I figured this was what? Some kind of test. <laughs> no. Nothing quite as formal as all that. As you can see, our pool of recruits isn't what it used to be. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, you passed. Oh, you ready to meet the Colonel? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why the hell not? <laughs> So St. John, where did you serve? 